The Air Force is exploring lightweight, low part count aircraft structures designed to be made through additive manufacturing. Pete Zielinski, Additive Manufacturing Media. I'm at Big Metal Additive and their facility in Denver, Colorado. They made these sections, uh, aluminum components, structural sections designed by the Air Force through topology optimization. Big Metal Additive does additive manufacturing through wire arc directed energy deposition. On a robot in some cases, on gantry machine tools in other cases, five axis machine tools that do metal deposition and machining as parts like these are being built. And the machining proved significant here. One thing that Big Metal Additive discovered, these structural forms actually perform their structural duty better if material is taken away. The as 3D printed form is beefier. The wall is about a quarter inch thick as printed. So heavier wall, but that printed form allows for stress concentration and that lowers fatigue life. By contrast, this form, smoother as you can see, while it was being 3D printed, it was also five axis milled, not just on the outside, but also on the inside as it was being built. The result, the wall thickness is much thinner. It's about a tenth of an inch versus a quarter of an inch here, but these smooth walls mean no stress concentration and much longer fatigue life, significantly longer. Under high frequency fatigue testing, a uh, structure that was only 3D printed, not machined, failed after 30,000 cycles. But the even lighter weight structure that was 3D printed and machined, that lasted multiple orders of magnitude longer. One failed at 30,000 cycles, the machined one failed at 2 million cycles. I filmed another video here at Big Metal Additive that has to do with challenging schedule. I'll post a link to that video in the description.